Overview. Compact sedans like the 2024 Elantra are frequently thought of as basic modes of transportation because they are fantastic for first-time vehicle purchases, economical with fuel, and simple to park in small spaces, but the Hyundai also offers a ton of style and a ton of value. Although the Elantra's outward design is striking, it doesn't scrimp on standard compact car features. For its size, the Elantra's cabin is roomy, and its reputation as a fuel-efficient vehicle is enhanced by a hybrid powertrain that is an option. The N-Line model has a turbocharged 1.6-liter engine that delivers a little more zing in place of the regular engine's sluggish 2.0-liter four-cylinder. None of the Elantra versions, though, will make the driver's heart race. Compared to peers like the Honda Civic and Mazda 3, which are both fun to drive, its handling is less exciting. What has changed for 2024? The front end of Hyundai's tiny car has been sharpened, and the outside lighting and wheels have also been modified. Exotic green and ultimate red are two of the new color options. As standard across the Elantra line, Hyundai has also incorporated rear-side impact airbags and a seatbelt reminder. All of these features lane keeping assistance, blind spot monitoring, and rear cross traffic alert now inform the driver via haptic pulses in the steering wheel. The optimum combination of price and functionality is provided by the mid-range SEL model. A hands-free trunk release and Sirius XM are included as standard features above the SE. Additionally, there are more beneficial options available if you choose the SEL over the SE. For example, we would check the SEL Convenience Package, which includes a 10.3-inch digital cluster in addition to the 10.3-inch infotainment system center display, adaptive cruise control, leather-wrapped steering wheel and shifter, a wireless smartphone charging pad, heated front seats, heated M performance engine, transmission, and other. A normally aspirated 2.0-liter four-cylinder engine with 147 horsepower and 132 pound-feet of torque is the standard non-hybrid Elantra powertrain. It is found under the hood of SE and SEL variants. By choosing the more athletic and line model, the displacement is reduced to 1.6 liters and a turbocharger is added, producing a much livelier 201 horsepower and 195 pound-feet of torque. The 1.6-liter four-cylinder engine is also used in the hybrid vehicles, but it is coupled with an electric motor rather than a turbo, which produces more torque 195 pound-feet, or the same amount of horsepower as the N-Line instead of horsepower. The CVT is connected to the base 2.0-liter engine in the SE and SEL. While the N-Line, Blue Hybrid, and Limited Hybrid versions receive a CVT continuously variable gearbox, they also receive a DCT dual-clutch transmission. Notably, the hybrids only have a 6-speed DCT, while the N-Line receives a 7-speed DCT. The performance-focused N, which we separately assess, is by far the most popular and enthusiast choice of the Elantra line. But those who find the price of such car too much to bear might want to think about the more moderate N-Line variant. We were thrilled with the N-Line's quicker acceleration and deft handling after a brief test drive, since they increase athleticism without degrading the ride. Time to 60 miles per hour in a Hyundai Elantra. In our test, the Hyundai Elantra 0-60 mph time was 8.1 seconds, while the hybrid Elantra 0-60 mph time was 8.4 seconds. For those seeking greater performance, the quicker Elantra and model reviewed separately is what they should look for. The 2.0-liter four-cylinder Elantra is predicted by the EPA to achieve up to 33 mpg in the city and 42 mpg on the interstate. 1.6-liter turbocharged four-cylinder models offer estimations of up to 28 mpg in the city and 36 mpg on the interstate. Elantra is the most fuel-efficient hybrid, with ratings of 53 city and 56 highway mpg. The Elantra Hybrid only achieved 48 mpg on our 75 miles per hour highway fuel economy route as part of our rigorous testing process, while the non-hybrid limited with the standard engine achieved 38 mpg. In contrast, a hybrid Corolla achieved 56 mpg during our highway test. Visit the EPA website for more details regarding the Elantra's fuel efficiency, cargo, comfort, and the interior. The interior of the Elantra seems adequately futuristic to match its striking outside. While the passenger side has a more understated style, the dashboard and center console surround the driver. 